It is important to pause and reflect on the importance and role of the Treaty of Westphalia, also known as the Peace of Westphalia, in examining the evolution of the modern state. The Thirty Years' War was a 17th century religious conflict fought primarily in Central Europe. It remains one of the longest and most brutal wars in human history, lasting from 1618 to 1648. It started as a battle among the Catholic and Protestant states that formed the Holy Roman Empire. Throughout the year 1648, the various parties signed a series of treaties called the Peace of Westphalia, effectively ending the Thirty Years' War. This treaty was achieved through complex diplomatic negotiations, resulting in a lengthy agreement containing 128 clauses covering matters of law, religion, and ethics, as well as numerous practical issues. This map shows us what the territory looked like once the Peace of Westphalia was signed in 1648. As you can see, various territories changed hands. Westphalia has been described as the first and perhaps the greatest of the modern European peace treaties, and is also considered to have established the legal foundations of modern statehood. Its principal feature concerns the right of rulers to conduct their affairs within their own territories, free from outside interference, thus establishing the principle of autonomous political authority, which underpinned the development of the doctrine of sovereignty. The model of this treaty provides a benchmark for both critics and supporters of the sovereign state system, as well as for those who predict its eventual demise due to the forces of globalization.